Highlighting Hive Pocracy Episode 4. On December 6th, Perplexed QT was on Granny's panel and said something vile to the subscriber mystery. This video is not about cancer wars, so stay focused. Matter, you can't take a link. Maybe you'll get cancer and it'll eat you from the inside out, bitch. The beehive was buzzing and ready to swarm in outrage over such a terrible things to wish upon someone who had battled cancer before. Yeah. What the fuck is that, dude? What the fuck? Are you fucking serious? Yeah, that, that shit blew the fuck out of me. After you just got done saying... After you just got done saying you were supposedly sorry for all the shit you had talked, and then you fucking turn around and do that? That's how I said, uh-uh. Words hold power, and apologies mean nothing when you continue the same behavior. Did she just say that? That statement alone is high hypocrisy. But let's continue. Yeah, the shit's fucking disgusting. I don't understand how she can keep going with this bullshit. You say you're sorry and that you didn't mean to say this and all this and that. What the fuck? After we just went over all the shit you said yesterday, or why would you say that shit? Why in the fuck would you say that? You hope it eats her from the inside out? That's fucking nasty, dude. Fucking nasty. Over this past weekend... Their prodigal bee voices went off and threatened to expose pre- and post-breast surgery pictures of a subscriber. They chuckled and consoled voices. Oh, I have no idea who Lindsay even is. Sit down and shut the fuck up because the next it's going to come out of your fucking tits. And I'll goddamn do it. Stop Ooh. pushing me, cut rag. Well, that's going to get clipped. So since I'll be in the clip, let me just say people who are sending Laura screenshots are busters and they need to fucking stop. What about the people sending screenshots to Queen B? Or maybe the fake emails that she never can produce? Are those people busters too because Queen B welcomes them? Why shouldn't Laura? Well then. Because <laughs> that's going to get clipped. <laughs> so... Queen Bee laughs at what was said, and that girl makes a joke about this vile threat being clipped. Not one person told voices this was too far or vile. Yeah, you know what, the Marine's daughter? Go tell Laura that. Go tell Laura. Her filthy fucking mouth does not make her right. Go when a sub calls out the vile thing said, Queen Bee deflects off of what voices has just done to point out that perplexed QT has a vile mouth. Do the Hive members have vile mouths? Does Queen Bee have a vile mouth? Don't tell her I'm that. Sorry. That was wrong. I am sorry. I've been pushed to my fucking limit. Voices apologizes and says she has been pushed to her limit. Let's see how the panel guests and owner respond. Well, that's why I asked her to email you because I knew that's what she was trying to do. That's why I was trying to just let that not happen. But God damn it. I... Don't get upset. It is what it is. It is well, I, I don't even know who you are, Lindsay, but okay. I Queen B does not even know who Lindsay is. Does this matter? Does Queen B know who Voices is? Does she know the vile things that come out of Voices' mouth? Or is this again not her fault and has nothing to do with her? Will Queen B ever be able to control her panel while in a lawsuit? Or does she even care?